Super Team Video Presentation Kategori University We are Team Robo Erectus One at Rescue from Singapore and I'm Kevin. I'm Faris. Hello, my name is Wai Firmansa from Federation IT, Indonesia. Hello. The purpose and objective in Super Team Challenge other than competition We can share our knowledge, do a collaboration, teamwork, problem solving, have fun, and gain experience. We have decided to use a star path writing algorithm to assist the robot in navigating around the map. It is the best popular technique for finding the shortest path to the target. This method consists primarily of three values, which are the F cost, H cost, and G cost. G cost is a movement cost from starting point to a given node, following the path generated to get there. While the H cost is an estimated movement cost to move from the given node to the final destination. The H cost is heuristic, which means that it is just an estimation and it is not determined to be the actual cost until the final destination is reached. F cost is the sum of G cost and H cost. The objective of this algorithm is to find the lowest F cost, which results in the most efficient and shortest path to be generated. Here is a flowchart of how the A-star pathfinding algorithm works. As you can see, the process of calculating the F cost, G cost, and H cost does not stop until the current calculated node is the target node or the goal. Once the current node reaches the target node, the loop breaks and the path from the starting point to the target point is generated. There are several methods to calculate the distance in the algorithm. For a star pathfinding algorithm, we have decided to use Euclidean distance for our H cost measurement because it gives us the most accurate shortest distance between nodes. And also in call space rescue, we are able to program the robot to move in any direction. An example of the Euclidean distance used for the measurement of the H cost of the given node can be seen in this diagram. The path generated as shown will be the estimated shortest road from the starting point to the target. This is how the robot finds the shortest road using the S-star pathfinding algorithm. There are two problem interfacing in my super team. First, black object in swamp area. The swamp can reduce the motor speed. And sometimes, my robot stuck when searching object in center of cycle. For the first problem, we decided to adjust the beam mapping for the code according to the loaded number of black objects. If the robot has not yet collected, two black objects, we will still be able to move inside the swamp land. If loaded black object is more than or equal to two, robot will avoid the swamp land. For the second problem, we added a new function to our code so that the robot will move backwards if it is stuck in the same position for six seconds. We will now show a video for our robot performance.
throughout the Super Team Challenge, we have learned to be more open-minded and adaptable to different strategy. This event has given us the chance to learn to communicate better with people from different backgrounds and nationality. Overall, it was a memorable experience for our Super Team. Thank you.